All right, YouTube, what is going on today? Um, back with the second duel of the day, and I continue to pick first for no reason. But, you know what, we're going to just start off with this, I guess. There's literally no reason for me to be picking first. There's literally no reason for me to be picking first. I continue subconsciously to be picking first, and I should not be picking first. But, let's go ahead and start off with this, and what we're going to get here is a circle of the Fire King, I believe. You son of a bastard. You son of a fucking bastard. Why do you do that? Why? Why do you why do you play these games? Oh, that sucks. Uh we probably I don't know. I'm thinking about putting a, a what's that, another worm in here. But anyways, uh yeah. If you guys do enjoy this video, leave a like, leave a comment, and also subscribe if you have not already. And if you guys can, click one of them ads for me. Appreciate it very much. Helps me out. Shows me appreciation. So yeah, we're playing against me. Oh no, not this funky ass deck. But um, I thought this deck was like really busted until I read like the actual card. And like if you did, if you all you got to do is just like dodge them, and it's like they can't activate. So that's good. But what sucks is that now he's going to pretty much be okay. He's gonna what? We're gonna draw two cards okay so let's not let's turn that off right there because that's going to be a problem damn he just had to have the fucking ghost ash and then look he ties the brethren draws two more that's fine and then uh yeah same column oh only if a magic bullet i thought it was just any card well look at that in the hand okay well i'm getting rid of this motherfucker because that motherfucker draw, uh what's it that motherfucker does work let's go ahead and kill you Probably gonna use something to get it killed. Um, if the spell trap activate in the same column as this card, you get something. Okay, well, that's the end of that, I guess. Um, but man, I seen Lithian's video on these motherfuckers, and I was like, damn, these. I, I really thought these motherfuckers were like out of control, broken. But when I realized like you have to use most of the shit in the same column, I was like, oh, okay. Right, and there's easy. This it's easy to be dodged. All right, he may be going for game, because if he's not going for game, that was not the greatest move of all time. If he's not going for game. But if he's going for game, then that's just it. Um, and it looks like he's not even attempting. He's going only for 2600. What are you doing, sir? Okay. Um, you can add one magic bullet card with a different name than the activated card, and then you can add one from your graveyard. Okay, so I'm just going to special summon it right over here blow his board and possibly get game possibly not though but let's see what's going on here it's going to be very it's going to be a big problem finding a lot of music for these backgrounds um <laughs> it's going to be a problem oh no that's even better um let's go ahead and activate that sadly our baranga if our baranga did get stopped i'm pretty sure we would have won about um turn two there we go, right over here. Just dodging all of these little effects. Pretty sure he's gonna have the, yeah, I was about to say. Okay, that one says, cannot be destroyed by card effects. And if this card is sent to the graveyard, what do you do? You add a magic bullet with the same, with a different name, correct? Um, it becomes zero and has effects negated. That's fine. Um, I want you to do that, sir. That's the, you can only use that one once per turn, so. That means if I attack this one, he's going to activate and he's going to get one from his graveyard. And I think that's fine. I really do think that's fine. So let's go ahead and attack you. Uh, oh, that's even better. I'm not even paying attention. I don't even know how half these cards to do. But I was about to take 1400 for literally no reason. See? So now he's going to just add a magic bullet with a different name back to his hand, which is going to be this card. No, he's going to add a monster. That's actually fine because this is going to trigger we're going to use Garunix and with Garunix we can go ahead and get Ganesha we special that motherfucker right on there and uh, we can just do that attack over the one that has to do something with battle damage I mean has to do something with adding from the deck once again that's fine because that's going to trigger <laughs> Ganesha's just going to get back uh, what should I get back? Should I get back Barong? 
So if I get back Barong, that's going to die. But if I get back Runix, that's going to die too. But then it's going to blow his board. And I think we're going to get back Runix. <laughs> because that's just cool. We're going to special summon that motherfucker right over here. And then we're going to attack over this. And we're going to kill you. And you, you both going to end up dying anyway. So it does, oh, actually, not really. I should have got the damn Barong. Um, yeah, I possibly should have gotten the wrong. Um, and here we go. This is how you get mind games going. Ooh. That was a fuck up. That was not supposed to happen. Because now he knows that this is, this is not the, you know, wait, does this need a magic bullet? Yes, he did. That's how he knows this is just, um, that's how he knows that this is not really anything. Because if I do activate something, uh, he's just activate. So I easily could have dodged that, but I didn't. All right, so what do you do? Okay, this is the draw two. And he has the Tides of Brother. Well, that's fine. We just need to get rid of this. We get rid of the doubles deal. I, f I feel like we can do it. We, we can beat him. This is going to be tricky, though. This is going to be tricky. So the Stormy's not going to activate, then that's fine. This is only 1100 damage. Um, here we go. Alright, now that's really good. Um, what does this do? This banishes a fire, but that does 1300. Hmm. That does 13, and we can get two Garunix in rotation. Well, might as well. Let's go for broke. See what we can do. Let's see what we can do. It's not really too much. With this card right here, we can't really do anything. Yada Garusu. Can you add something with the uh right? Uh, I'm pretty sure in damage step he's gonna activate. And is he? He is. Okay, that's fine. This is cool. Because now I'm gonna get the Ganesha. This is all fine and dandy. And get you right over here. And I'll have to okay, wait, you already used the doctor, so I don't I don't care. He didn't use this. But that must mean he doesn't have one in his hand. That's fine though. That's all fine. Maybe these two. Um, yeah, let's activate you. I don't need to be gated. Pop, pop. Bam. Banish a monster. Um, not the doctor. What do you do? This one adds from the deck. We're banishing you. We're going to use Ganesha to go ahead and get back Varong. Right there. Doesn't really matter. We're both going to die in the end phase. Um, Varong dies. Let's go ahead and activate the Runix. It's going to come back right here. That's going to kill myself. This is going to trigger. Wrong is going to get us a search. Let's see how far we can get. Don't tell me you have another. Oh my fucking gosh. How am I supposed to win when I can't even resolve one fucking Barong? Let's like one Barong out of all the things on the planet. They got Ghost Ogre, I mean Ghost Ash twice. He got Ghost Ash twice. He literally top decked it. Top decked the fucking Ghost Ash. That sucks so much balls. All if I did, if I just had, if I just went second, we would all been fine and dandy. We'd all been fine and dandy. I feel like we we have a chance to win though. Oh, that's that. Yeah, we we we're, we're definitely winning here, folks. Um, we're definitely winning here, folks. We're definitely uh, getting the, the victory out of this one. Because we can negate any effect right now. Pop. We're, we're just all... We're, yeah. We're in the business. We're in the business for winning right now. We are in the business for winning. And this, Okay, so magic bullets aren't, aren't that broken. And I really thought Tenzu was right here for some reason. I really thought Tenzu was right there for some reason. But I feel like we have we have control. I mean, it took us 10 turns, but I feel like we have control. I feel like we can win. I really feel like we're doing pretty good right now. 
Yeah, so I, I thought magic bullets is like really just super powerful and shit. I mean, they, I mean they're they're cool, but I mean it's not it's not it's not it's not as broken as I thought. All you gotta do is play around. And that's the real problem with column cards. Is you can easily play around it. There we go. So beat um, the young. Uh, what are they called? Magic bullets. Be right back with the deck profile. So yeah, man, beat the uh, beat the magic bullets in our first try. Not really that hard. Uh, that's that's that, that's just a problem with column cards. Is that w once you re when people read, you can just play around all of them. And like that right there, he just got shut down. So thank you guys for watching. We got one more duel later on today. Be back. Stay tuned. Watch out.